Well, a warning about a new email scam that may look more believable than those you may have seen before. Fox 11's Lou Hillman takes a closer look. If you know Tom Duffy, don't worry, he's not broke or stranded in London. Though a message sent from his email account this morning says otherwise. The best they tell me is that someone guessed my password. He thinks the email was sent to the nearly 500 people on his contact list. Those who wrote back even got a response from the hacker requesting them to wire $2,500 overseas to help Duffy. So far, he doesn't think anyone has actually sent the funds. I hope not, because they're going to want it back from me. <laughs> now, if you have an email account, you've likely received a phishing email at some point, but those usually come from an unknown sender. Authorities say what makes this case so concerning is that the scammers are sending messages from an email address you probably recognize. They'll use your email to get out the initial message, and then when you reply, They'll put in some kind of code to where you're replying directly to them and not to the original person. Officer Will Pearson with the Seymour Police Department says this scam starts with a hacker stealing a user's contacts list. He says many of the problems are with Gmail and Yahoo accounts. The more mainstream accounts are always more at risk because they're just more accessible. Duffy has had the same Yahoo email address and password for more than a decade. The internet company is now working with him to get a new account. The lady asked me, uh, she said, uh, When's the last time you changed your password? And I said about 14 years ago. Authorities say a better idea is to change it every month or two. In Seymour, Lou Hillman, Fox 11 News. Officers also say if you receive an email asking for help, even if it is from someone you know, before committing to anything, contact that person first.